Again, in the news, this is trending now, the concept of all these illegal, unlicensed, pseudo, non-healthcare professionals doing illegal treatments on people. Three women contracted HIV in New Mexico, getting vampire facelifts, which is not only sad um, how hor horrendous it is that people are contracting HIV due to dirty needles and things like that, but these vampire facials, which don't do anything anyway. PRP may do things, V-cell PRP, but like putting your own blood and microneedling it on the face is really just Instagram, TikTok fodder. Uh, again, it's really all just reinforcing uh, the need for regulation within the aesthetic industry, really monitoring who's performing these services, what consents and regulatory aspects and information are provided to the patients getting them. I know all you out there think that, oh, this would never happen to me. I only go to legitimate people, only sketchy people um, get put in situations with unlicensed providers, but you would be shocked how many apparently legitimate providers are out there that are not. I know board certified physicians that are doing illegal practices. So please do your research. Make sure you're being treated by licensed healthcare professionals. Make sure you are doing procedures that have some sort of legitimacy, studies, research, uh, and make sure you're being consented and you're treated in a sterile medical environment. So I'm glad that this stuff is trending. Uh, and again, it's more of a word to the wise. Have a great week. You're going to be seeing more than enough of me.